Hey guys, welcome back to Mountain Dog Companion. Thanks for tuning in again. Um, in today's video, we're gonna be talking about Heather and Charles's Greater Swissy litter. Um, they're about a week and a half old and doing great. Um, there's three girls over here on my left and then there's also four boys over here. Um, just doing great, everyone's wonderfully marked, just um, really coming out. They're just starting to open their eyes, so they're just getting used to seeing the world um, and not getting so active yet. So the personalities are a little bit harder to see at this point. Um, but in today's video, I'm just gonna be going through talking about each one's markings, um, their size comparing in the litter, which can still change um, for sure. It's still super early on, so. Um, but I'm gonna be starting off with the three girls here, starting off with the bigger girl for sure. Um, and she is very beautifully marked. You can see that collar wrapping around the top. Uh, I'm getting a little bit squirmy here. Um, but that collar, um, the stripe kind of wraps over the top and wraps around uh, kind of like a collar would. Nice tan and white um, socks there, uh, front and back. Beautiful overall, the tan eyebrows. Uh, wonderful looking girl here. Um, and she is the bigger one in, um, as far as the girls go. Um, she's definitely one of the bigger ones, so. It's okay, it's okay. Uh, next up is um, the second to largest girl here. She has a little bit of a Swiss kiss here on the top, um, and she is not enjoying this. Um, but she has a nice white stripe in between her eyes, um, some nice tan points, tan points on the side as well, and has those tan and white socks as well. Um, a white tip tail too. Medium sized girl, not the smallest, not the biggest. Beautiful markings. Um, I think these guys are all gonna be wonderful, so. Um, and everyone's doing great at the time, so no health concerns right now. Um, of course, we do that preliminary health check um, with the veterinarians just, just to make sure everyone's good, but so far, so good, so. Um, last but not least is a smaller girl in the litter. Not super small, not the runt by any means. Um, but definitely on the smaller side. Um, she kind of has a unique marking. So um, her stripe here wraps around to around the top and then uh, kind of wraps only on one side in a collar form there. Um, but the other side is completely black. So a really unique look here. Um, she has those that white chest here, um, tan markings on the side, tan points, um, the white socks at the bottom, white socks on the hind feet as well, and that white tip tail too. So. Um, those are the girls from Heather, um, Heather and Charles's litter. Um, I would say somewhere between 110 to 150 pounds uh, for these guys. Uh, typically the boys tend to be a little bit bigger, the girls tend to be a little bit smaller, so. Um, but these were the girls here. Um, I'd say the girl here on the right, um, the bigger girl, she, she's gonna be a big girl for sure. Um, just really, really nice size, a big teddy bear, so. Um, so next up, we're gonna be talking about the boys here. Um, this is one of the smaller boys. He's coming around now. Um, not the smallest, but um, definitely one of the smaller ones. So um, beautiful markings, those tan points on the side. Um, white stripe, white socks, front and back. Um, and he does not have a white tip tail, so. Um, but overall, just wonderful. Those tan markings really coming out. He's gonna be a nice little guy for sure. Um, and this size is still, you know, it can still change for sure. Um, it's still su super early on, so it's not like he's gonna be the smallest one um, forever, so, or the smaller one. Um, next up is the biggest boy in the litter. Um, he's huge, he's got two greater, or two um, Swiss kisses here on the top here. Um, you can see kind of a unique look as well. The white stripe in between the eyes um, also has that, those tan markings on the feet, um, the white socks front and back, and a little bit of a white spot on the back of his tail. Um, beautiful guy, he's probably the bigger guy in the litter um, just overall at the time, so um, he's gonna be really nice as well. Next up, we're gonna be talking about the medium sized boy in the litter. Nice stripe going over top, kind of a unique look again. He doesn't have that collar wrapping around, but has a little bit of a black spot up top. It's kind of a, a nice look. Uh, beautiful boy, white socks as well. A white socks front and back, tan running down the legs. Um, 
tan on the side there on the cheek area um, and that stripe is just kind of cool um, I really like seeing that so um, beautiful guy he's the medium guy in the litter um, and last but not least is a smaller guy in the litter um, he's not so much smaller as the guy here on the right um, but definitely a little bit smaller so um, he has that white tip tail the white stripe running back um, towards the shoulder area and kind of wrapping around in a collar fashion there around the side um, white stripe in between the eyes tan points um, eyebrows there on the side of, of the cheeks as well and tan running down those legs so um, beautiful litter overall just everyone's super well marked um, and super healthy at the time so um, everyone's doing great and the girls are over here snoozing away so um, everyone's just kind of relaxed and still um, at this point in time it's very normal for them to be sleeping most most of the time um, other than their their eating hours is kind of um, pretty much the only time they're awake or when I'm disturbing them so um, but everyone's doing great this is Heather and Charles's litter um, they're about a week and a half old. They'll be between. They'll be around 110 to 150 pounds. Um, just big teddy bears. Everyone's doing great. So, um, thanks again, guys, for tuning in. Um, I'm Jay with Mountain Dog Companion. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out. My number is 330-234-0102. You can always email us at mountaindogcompanion at gmail.com or feel free to check out our website at mountaindogcompanion.com. Thanks for tuning in. Take care.